Hello again, this is Jesse Cloninger. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about, um, this is video two in the series of videos about triads. Uh, what we're looking at is an incomplete version of what I call the triad grid. It's my famous in all 50 states triad grid. I don't know. It's not famous. Don't quote me on that. It might be famous. It might be famous after this video. Anyway, here we go. So, we're going to write down the four qualities of triads here. So we have major, we have minor triads, we have augmented, and we have diminished triads. So this grid is going to tell us, if we go across this way, for major triads, what is the quality of the third in a major triad? What is the quality of a fifth in a major triad? And it's going to explain to us how to notate that, or the nomenclature. How do we write a chord symbol for major triads? So the next line would be minor triad, what quality of third, what quality of fifth, and so on. So let's fill this in. The little boxes are going to be half steps. So major thirds, or major triads, excuse me, have major quality thirds, which are four half steps. Major triads have perfect fifths, which are seven half steps. And we notate major triads by using capital letters. And so we would, for example, it would be B flat or F sharp. And if we saw this, we would know that it was B flat major because it's a capital letter with no additional symbols and it's not a lowercase letter. This is F sharp major. So minor triads, going to the next line, of course have minor thirds. Clearly I've written a lowercase m here. Clearly up here in major I've written an uppercase m. I love it when people are specific about that. I don't have to guess. So minor triads have minor thirds which are three half steps. They have perfect fifths, which are also seven half steps. And we notate minor triads with lowercase letters. So it'd be like lowercase b flat or lowercase f sharp. So if we just saw this by itself and it was saying, you know, b flat, that would mean based on what we do in this class, B-flat minor triad. Number three in our lineup, augmented triads, have major thirds, which are four half steps, and they have augmented, ha, huh, the namesake, augmented triads, which are eight half steps. And we write augmented triads, capital letters, with a plus sign. And you don't need the quotes, I'm just putting it there uh, to indicate that that is what you need. You need a plus sign. So it would be B flat plus or F sharp plus. Last but not least, we have our diminished triads. Diminished triads have a minor third, three half steps, and they have a diminished fifth, also their namesake, which would be six half steps. Diminished triads are notated with lowercase letters with what we call a degree sign or a lowercase uh, o. Either one is fine, how if you want to imagine that. So they have a lowercase letter. So B flat diminished, or F sharp diminished. Now, if you already play a little bit of guitar or piano or ukulele or auto harp or whatever chordal instrument you might play, you've probably seen on the sheet music a lot of different variations of how to notate chords. Um, let me move this around for a second. For instance, you've probably seen 
B flat major or B flat plus or B flat capital M. In the real world, these are all versions that mean the same thing. They all pretty much mean B flat major. But for our purposes, you can just use the capital letters. Same thing with minor. You'd see B flat minor, B flat minor 7, B flat M, or B flat. Well, you'll notice that all of these have capital letters. We don't use any of these. We just use a lowercase letter for our minor triads. Same goes for augmented and diminished. There's many, many different ways to use nomenclature to identify these triads, but for these purposes, let's stick with major is capital letters with nothing else, minor is lowercase letters with nothing else, augmented is capital with a plus sign for the sharp five, and the diminished triads are lowercase with the degree sign, or the lowercase zero. You don't have to worry about if you type this in your computer, it's okay to use the lowercase, sorry, lowercase o, because um, doing the whole superscript thing can be a pain. Anyway, this is the triad grid, um, and I will, I've posted a PDF of this so you can download and use this for reference in class. Hope it helps.